Salutations and greetings, ego hackers. Welcome to today's video where we'll be discussing the cognitive function known as FE, or extroverted feeling. So what is FE? FE is a cognitive function that 8 of the 16 types use to make decisions. FE is all about ethics. Ethics is the extroverted feeler's awareness of how people around them feel, and specifically what they value. So just as a TE user compares different people's thoughts to each other, FE users compare values to each other. This can come in the form of comparing moral codes to more practical comparisons of weighing out the priorities for a given task or project. There are eight FE users, the SFJs, the NFJs, the SDPs, and the NTPs. They all have extroverted feeling in the top four slots of their cognition. FE is fundamentally tied to empathy. All FE users have a natural and even uncanny ability to discern the moods, feelings, and emotional pain of those around them. Whereas an FI user has an independent emotional reaction, they offer their own feelings and feedback in response to a situation, an FE user feels the literal feelings of people around them. While their compassion often leads to healing, it can also lead to enablement. Sometimes FE users rush in to alleviate pain immediately, which can jeopardize another person's growth if the FE users aren't careful. FE users have to learn when it's time to step in and be compassionate, and when it's time to step back and let the person figure things out for themselves. The secret reality of being truly helpful is that stepping back at the right time can be just as compassionate as stepping in at the right time. So what are FE users seeking? FE users seek moral integrity, personal philosophy, feedback, and appreciation from other people. Unconsciously, they're looking for people with the complementary function of introverted feeling, or FI. FI users are the ones who most want to be emotionally comforted by FE users and FE users are naturally gifted at helping FI users process emotional pain and moral struggle. FE users are seeking appreciation from FI users. FE users put a lot of effort to create harmony and provide emotional relief to others in their life. FE users also absorb and refine the values of FI users in their life. But more than anything, an FE user wants others to value them enough to invest in them. That's why we refer to FE's complementary function, FI, as the investment function. An FE user flourishes when others invest their own values, philosophy, and so forth into the FE user. An FI user's investment confirms to the FE user that they are indeed worthy of investment. Not only will the FE user continue to comfort and provide care to those who invest in them, but it helps the FE user feel valued enough to be honest with the FI users in their life. FE is tied through cognitive access to introverted thinking, or TI. So every FE user is also a TI user, just as every FI user is also a TE user. So what is the significance of this? It demonstrates how an FE user can actually heal others. TI adds the logical structure to help guide the FE user into taking action. TI processes other people's feeling and seeks to understand what specifically can be done to help a person. If somebody has all empathy and no logic, they will only relieve pain and become a doormat whose only purpose is to give themselves away to other people. They'll comfort others, but they won't heal them. When the FE user utilizes their TI, they start to see who they should comfort and who they should leave alone. TI also helps the FE user apply the right solution so that their compassion is not wasted and true healing becomes possible. How can extroverted feelers make the right decisions? As stated in the beginning, FE is a decision-making function. It gathers the values of the people around them and compares them against each other to find the best values. In this way, FE users are like treasure hunters of value, sifting through the sands and digging through the earth of competing values to find gems in each value system. But the FE user can't help but be sucked into, at least a little bit, absorbing what those around them value. So the danger for FE users is in becoming too prone to accept new values on a whim simply because those around them accept that value. If they value it, then it must be valuable, is an example of an immature FE user's perspective on ethics. For an extroverted feeler to practice FE in maturity, they must also utilize their TI function. At the risk of not being accepted by others, a mature FE user verifies the accuracy of the values that others feel are important. Just because a person values a specific thing doesn't make it true. Just because someone feels slighted by a boss doesn't make it true. Just because we feel like doing harm to someone who angered us doesn't make it right. If the FE user does not verify the truth in other people's values, it will lead to enablement. And when enough enablement is permitted, destruction of families, groups, cultures, and even entire nations will follow. 
but armed with the truth and courageous enough to verify others' values, FE users can become dynamic and effective with their compassion. So truthful compassion, then, is the expression that FE users should seek in all situations. Within truthful compassion, an FE user's empathy becomes a valuable and rare resource. So truthful compassion, TI plus FE, impacts others with extreme potency, providing the best path for actual lasting healing. And in the process of healing others, FE users can find healing for themselves too. If you liked this video, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. And until next time, thank you for watching.